And that was, do our beliefs about what we're eating change our body's physiological response to that food, holding constant the objective nutrients of that thing? So that question might sound outrageous at first, but it was... It's really not outrageous if you're coming from a place of having studied in depth placebo effects. So placebo effects are this robust demonstration in which simply taking a sugar pill, taking nothing, under the impression that it's a real medication that might relieve your asthma, reduce your blood pressure, boost your immune system, can lead to those physiological effects, even though there's no objective nutrients. And we have more evidence on placebo effects than we have for any other drug <laughs> because, really? of, because of the clinical trial mm -hmm. process in which all new drugs and medication are, medications are required to outperform a placebo effect. So we have a lot of data on the placebo effect. But anyways, going back to this question, it was like, all right, we've moved from you know, medications solving our health crises to behavioral medicine solving our health crises, increase people's exercise, get them to eat better. To what degree are these things influenced by our mindsets or beliefs about them? So to test this question, we ran a seemingly simple study. 